Okay guys, apologize for the dirty truck, but we've been running. We ran through a swarm of bees or something. But uh, Melissa, if she will, I don't know where she went. She's gonna do the engine compartment pre-trip. So the hood's already open. Whenever you're ready, go for it. We're gonna just let her run through it. Um, under the truck. And there are none. No leaks under the truck. We're going to come over here. We're going to check the general passenger side hoses. They are properly mounted and secured at both ends. Not cracked, they're broken, not leaking. Then we're going to check under here the belt-driven alternator. And that I know. Okay, it's properly mounted and secured, not cracked, been or broken. The wires are okay. attached. When you're when you're talking about the alternator, Pointing yeah, because you're pointing out this tube here. Oh yeah. So okay. you want a, the belt driven alternator. Okay, it's securely mounted, secured, not cracked, been or broken. The wires are attached. The belt is not frayed or worn, and the free play is between a half and three quarters of an inch. Now we're gonna walk over to the driver's side. Dirty truck, dirty truck. Dirty truck. Okay. Oh wait, squirrel moment. Hold on. Oh, squirrel moment. Man, look at the damn wear and tear on this tire. Look, look at the wear indicator. Squirrel. Gone. 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 Just in that section, gone. There's a big divot in it. Okay, go ahead. Dang, man, you totally squirreled it. Squirreled my tree truck. Okay, go ahead. Okay, now we're going to come over to the driver's side. We're going to check the general hoses. Probably mounted and secured at both ends. Not cracked, better broken, and not leaking. And over here, we're going to go to the Gary driven air compressor. Properly mounted and it's probably secured. Probably mounted and secured, not cracked, better broken, and not leaking. And then we're gonna come over here to the gear-driven power steering pump. Properly mounted, secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, not leaking. And the oil, the dipstick, and that is filled to manufacturer specifications. And we're gonna come to the belt-driven uh, water pump, right? Yeah. yeah. What are, What are you talking about? Where do you point to it? There yes. you go. Okay. <laughs> Probably mass cured, not cracked, been or broken, not leaking, and the belt is not frayed or worn, and it has a free play of between half inch and three quarters of an inch. Now we're going to go to the coolant, not cracked, been or broken, probably mass secured, and not leaking for the manufacturer's specifications. Now we're going to go down to the power steering fluid, and that is not, that's probably mass secured, not cracked, been or broken. Build the manufacturer specification, they're not leaking. And then we are going to go to the, the that's the gear thing, right? The gear thing? The gear box. And steering gear box. And and hose. Yes. God, that one gets me every time. Yep. Okay. Remember, that's... worst case scenario if you're doing it and you can't I mean just point to it and okay. I the, don't steering, that uh, the steering uh yeah. box. I mean you might still get credit right. if he knows you're talking about right. uh the part you're talking it's about. Probably, I remember the part of the name. It's probably mounted secured, not cracked, then or broken. And no abrasions, bulges, or cuts. Hose is properly mounted and secured at both ends, not leaking. Properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, no abrasion, bulges, or cuts, and not leaking. Yeah. Isn't that what I just said? Yeah, you added uh, uh, hoses probably mounted and secured at oh, both well, ends, uh, which is fine. Right. More is better. Right. Okay. Then we have the steering link, which is, consists of the pitman arm, the drag link, and the push tie rod. Tie rod, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, and it's got three castle nuts and cotter pins, and none are missing. Point to that third one. There Over you go. Here. Okay. Okay, it's securely mounted and. It's what? Securely mounted. Properly mounted. <laughs> Probably mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken. Uh, now, okay. now, do you see why now you're standing there going, what? That's because the way you do it, you do it in a weird order. Just come to it. 
My steering linkage, properly mounted, secured, not cracked, bent, or broken. It consists of my oh, uh, pitman nice. arm, drag link, tie rod. It has three, three? castle nuts castle nut. and uh, cotter, uh, cotter pins. pins, and none cotter are missing. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, you told me that before. Okay. And then we're going to go down to the spring hanger. Mm -hmm. right. Spring hanger, probably mounted, secured, not cracked, bent, or broken. And... got it. And then Oh, probably mounted secured. Did I do it over? Okay, spring hangers. Probably mounted and secured at both ends. Not cracked, bent, or broken. The spring arm. Probably mounted and secured at both ends. Not cracked, bent, or broken. And it has not shifted. You bolts. Probably mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, and none are missing. And then the slack adjuster and push rod. Right? Yeah. Probably mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken. And with the brakes released and pulled by hand, the uh, push rod does not move more than one inch. Now we have the brake hose. Properly mounted and secured at both ends, not cracked, bent, or broken, and not leaking air. And we have the brake chamber, properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, and broken, and not leaking in. Shock absorber, <laughs> properly mounted and secured at both ends, not cracked, bent, and broken, and not leaking. Okay, and then we have the brake drum, properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken. And then we have the brake lining, properly mounted and secured, not bent, not cracked, bent, or broken, no oil or debris, and the friction material. Is that worn dangerously thin? Okay, and then we have the steer tire, which is probably mass secured, not cracked, but no. No abrasions, bulges, or cuts on the tread or the sidewalls. The tread is no less, the tread depth is no less than 4 30 seconds of an inch. And it's filled to manufacturer specifications, checked with an air gauge. And we have the rim. Probably mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, no unauthorized welds. And we have the lug nuts. Properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, none are missing, no rust trail or powder residue, and no holes, no cracks on the bolt holes. And we have the hub seal, not cracked, bent, or broken, uh, probably mounted and secured, not leaking, filled to manufacturer specifications. That concludes the engine compartment. Okay, that was good. That was of good. I get tongue tied here and there, but you know yeah. I've been getting tongue tied. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and pause this.